Hey guys, good morning. Guess who's on the way to the gym? This girl right here. It is about 9.20. I'm actually going to be late. Poo. Because you know me and time management, they just go together like what? carrots and trees. I don't, know what I don't know what that means. Um, anyway, I'm not a good time manager. I actually need to start getting up earlier also. Because what I've been doing is setting my alarm for 7.20 and then hitting snooze for a 30 minute period, one snooze. I'm waking up at 7.50 and trying to get out the door at 8.20. It's not going too good. Okay. Um, I had one of those flurry whatever bars that I bought yesterday at Walgreens um, that are on special this week, are on register reward, free deal, promotion, whatever you want to call it. Um, number one. It does not have Reese's Pieces in it, like I thought. Uh, it took me about five minutes to chew one bite. But there are 16 grams of protein in it and about 170 calories and only two grams of sugar, so could have been a lot worse. And as far as I know, protein is best for kind of long-lasting energy I think like carbohydrates are good for like a burst of energy I don't know I'm no kind of expert but that, I'm, I think that's what I heard so anyway I had that this morning for breakfast and some water and um, I ordered a brand new yoga mat off target.com uh, the other day because I saw on southernsavers.com that they were having a special and there were some codes that they had listed there um, so it was like eight dollars for this uh, cool yoga mat and since I have a Target card I get five percent off of any purchase in store or online and I get free shipping off anything online so that's freaking awesome so it ended up being like still about eight dollars um, after tax and free shipping so I'm waiting for that to come in the mail and as I mentioned in last night's vlog clap 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 um, I want to be quiet for a second I'm planning on going to body flow five days a week Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Sunday. That's the plan. Don't know if that's going to happen, and even if I only make it two or three times out of the five, that'll still be awesome. But I'd actually like to start making this part of my schedule. So I've got all the times and... and places because I go between two different Y's on my cozy calendar C-O-Z-I one of the most awesome organizational websites I've ever seen in life um, so anyway I'm on my way there I'm looking forward to it it gets done at 1030 go back home for a little while again and then go pick Madison up. Um, my table leader from Women's Bible Study, uh, which starts this Thursday, yay, um, asked me if I would be willing to help be like a sign in like a sister person to like help people assistant not a sister <laughs> right. 
a sister assistant um, to help people sign in into the computer system and print their little name tags and everything. So I have to go in tomorrow to the church and meet with the administrative secretary to kind of get a little training, if you will, uh, so that I know what I'm doing so that I can help people sign in. Because I'm there early anyway because it doesn't start till 9, the women's Bible study, but I drop Madison off at 8.30 and so it's like I'm always there like 15, 20 minutes early and it's like already a two hour thing. So it's like all of Thursday morning pretty much. Anyway, except for, uh, anyway, that's what I'm doing tomorrow morning. I'm sorry, I'm so disorganized, discombobulated this morning. Um, but this class right now that I'm going to at 9.30 is the only morning body flow class, I think, out of the whole week. I think all the rest of them are either at 4, 4.30, 5, or 5.30. Um, which is good and bad in the same way. I feel like I have more energy in the afternoon. Like I've had a chance to get up and like have my day and get annoyed with the kids and need a break. <laughs> um, but in the morning it's good to do it just to get it out of the way. And so it's like not even on your plate anymore, you know? It's like you just get up, you do it, it's done. You don't have to like think the whole day about it. Like, oh yeah, today I have to go, today I have to go, I have to go later. Uh, three more hours I have to go. Um, so that's kind of annoying. But what I did was just make a list of every time that they had it and then just put it on the calendar and so that's what happened. I'm babbling now, I'm sorry, I'm going to go, and, uh, yeah. Oh my goodness. Whew, that class was really hard. The first class, like, it's hard to explain, like, it's all the same class, because it's all called body flow, but at the different locations with the different instructors, they do different, called releases, which is, like, different episodes of a show. You know what I mean? It's like, so anyway, that release was like really hard because I think it was a new one and it was like the warm up was like, well, it was arms and legs, but like, I gotta stop saying legs so much. Makes my, it made my arms really, really burn. And then, I mean, just the whole class was really tough, but good. And of course, I'm proud of myself for going. I did miss my mommy's call though. She's been calling me about 10 every other day. Um, so she's probably like, you knew I was going to call. Where were you? Okay. Um, so anyway, it's already like 10.45. We'll be home long enough for me to take a quickie shower, maybe, before we go pick up Madison from school, come back home, make lunch. No, want a snack. Well, Alana's going to get a snack before I jump in the shower, because most of the time, I don't need a shower after body flow, but today is a different story. <laughs> 